Oh, hi, I'm Cleo, and I'm Whitney, and we're from Period 5. And hi, I'm Celine, the loner from Period 6. And this is our... Ready, ready! I know you'd be jealous. The following demonstration was conducted under extremely precise conditions. Do not, I repeat, do not attempt this demonstration at home. What is air resistance? An air resistance, which is also called drag, refers to forces that oppose the relative motion of an object through a fluid, liquid, or gas. Uh, papers are the same, except one can be crumpled. Now Cleo is going to demonstrate air resistance for us with the crumpled paper and the normal paper. So go. See, this one is still flying because of air resistance. Lesson. Everything falls to the earth at the same rate, independent of its composition. So this is a baseball, and this is a volleyball. They have different masses, so this is big and fat. Well, this is big, but this is heavy. Okay, but when I drop them, See, Whitney is on the roof, which is very bad. She has a volleyball. Hold up the volleyball. She has a baseball. You know, it's kind of dark. You can still see it. Okay, and she's going to drop them. Are you guys ready? Okay, one, two, drop. Pop quiz. What objects have a force of gravity? Only the Earth, very big objects, or all objects. The answer is all objects. How do you make a sheet of paper fall as quickly as possible? Attach a parachute to it, crumble it up into a ball, cut it in half. The answer is crumple it up into a ball. How is gravity on the moon different from gravity on the earth? Far less, far more, there is none. Is there that there is or was? Is there?